Hey, what's up everybody? This is Dexter with Russo's Reptiles and today we are going to talk about 2021 breeding plans. So the first pair I'm going to talk about uh, in this video is going to be Grinch, a normal female, and Damien, my Pastel Dream IMG. Um, I'm going to go ahead and say this now. I don't think this pair is actually going to happen. Um, it, it's a plan. That's what you know, uh, I would love to see it happen this year, but the thing that would hold it up would be Damien. Damien is young. Damien, age-wise, he'll make it. He'll be right around 18, 19 months, which is young, but it could happen. And size-wise, I, I don't, I don't think he'll make it, but I would love to see it happen. Um, it's one of those things. We'll just wait and see what he looks like when it's time. If he's not of size or I don't think he's ready, no big deal. He'll be put back on the side for another year or two. And I have a backup with Ciroc, my call albino. Or we just won't do a pair and we'll leave it to the other ones. It's not that big a deal. Um, I would rather not rush him into it if he's not ready kind of thing. Um, and maybe how I'll see that is I'll, I'll introduce him. And if he has no interest, then that'll probably be it for uh, for him this year or next year. But we'll we'll, we'll see. Uh, the reason I'm doing this pairing, so normal IMGs, you don't see them. They don't exist. I don't, I don't know if anybody else has found a normal IMG. Nobody makes them. Everybody makes combos. So to have normal IMGs on the market, I think would be nice. Uh, they're hard to find. And then also the Pastel Dream. Pastel Dream was uh, Jeff Ronnie's first uh pastel line it, it was the original and it's a polygenic thing so it's a line bred uh thing i think if i take the normal and the pastel dream from uh damien i might get one maybe two that pop out in the litter which would be nice uh nice reduction of black and a crisp pattern in the pastels um there's so many pastels out now there's uh, Ferrari, Pink Flamingo, Red Rum, uh, a lot of them. A lot of them are VPI. So it'd be nice to go back to the Pastel Dream. You don't really see too many uh, Pastel Dream monster tails. You know, you don't you don't really hear that name that much anymore. So it'd be nice to bring that back. Um, and then, yeah, that's pretty much it. I I don't see this one happening. I would love to see it happen though. Uh, I'd really love to produce some IMGs. I know it's like the gene right now. Everybody loves it. Uh, I'm enjoying watching Damien grow and get darker. So, but uh, yeah, let's get into it and I'll show you some pictures of what they look like and some possible outcomes from that breeding. Here you have Damien, a pastel IMG on the left and Grinch, a normal on the right. And here is another image of Grinch out in the sun. She has some really nice iridescence, some great coloring. And here's a close up of Damien. As you can see, he he's very small. Like like I said, I I really don't see this one happening next year, but uh, it's in, it's in the plans. And here you have the calculator on Morph Market, just a normal 2A Pastel Dream IMG. And here are the results. It'll be 50% IMG possible Pastel Dreams, and the rest will be normal possible Pastel Dreams. So, as you see, uh, it'll be, you know, 50%, boom, IMG, and the rest will be normals. Um, and it will really be up to what the whole litter looks like and stuff that I've seen in the past, I'm probably honestly going to need help with identifying the pastel dreams. Um, yeah, I, I'll be honest. I'll probably need help. Um, I think the normals may be a little more obvious, uh, but the IMG, which, you know, it's supposed to be a reduction of black. And then here you are with a snake that comes out darker already as it is with more speckling. So I think the IMGs are going to be hard to point up to pick out. 
but uh yeah that's that's the first pairing for next year hopefully if not then we'll have a bunch of head calls no big deal or we just won't have a pair we'll save it for the following year but uh thank you guys for watching um thank you for subscribing hitting the like buttons um do me a favor please share share the video the videos if you hit the share button and you put it on your facebook it it, it helps a lot uh liking helps a lot subscribing obviously helps a lot um also follow us on instagram uh russo's reptiles uh just just search that i don't have a link i'll, I'll probably need to put a link in the description i know a lot of you come from instagram already so what's up instagram people um that's kind of my, my my big base is, is my instagram uh followers and yeah just hit me up shoot me a message uh i'm down to shoot the shit with any of y'all and and you might teach me something because i don't know everything i barely know like five percent of this hobby i'm yeah i'm still learning i'm still a rookie i'm still a newbie a noob so shoot me a message hit me up uh throw some comments below tell me if you like that combo tell me if you think it sucks uh don't care if you think it sucks but yeah uh i hope you have a good day evening morning night whatever time it is hope you all had a good thanksgiving and later